Thanks for spending part of your Tuesday with us on Mid Morning. A couple of mornings are going out to Facebook users. One involves fake coupons that claim to offer deals ahead of Mother's Day. Who would do that to mom? Terrible. The other may seem innocent. Maybe you even took part in it, but posting the names of those 10 concerts you've been to, remember you post 10, one is a lie. That might have some unintended security consequences, too. Mm -hmm. Let's talk first about the coupons, because this is a time of year we're all doing the shopping for mom. And there are two coupons that have been passed around. And honestly, if you think about it, you would probably say, like, gosh, 75 bucks off at that yeah. Yeah. and beyond. That right. seems but unlikely. It's too good to be true. Too good to be true. But when you're not, you know, when your guard's not up and you see it right there and it, all it takes is one click. Just and click. You can have just that do it. Well, and you have a friend who shares it. I, yeah. I might have fallen for I think for we it. can show you one of mm -hmm. them. One is for Lowe's, and you see we've stamped uh, over it or, or someone has stamped over it. A scam, but fifty dollars off. That looks just like a Lowe's gift card. Lowe's coupon says Happy Mother's Day. Get a Lowe's gift card. So the scam is that you click on it, yeah. and then they say, Oh, you know, maybe it says re-log in, so you yeah. can see this image. Your like, password, oh. your email, which you have to do for a lot of things you on do. Facebook. Correct. Yep. So be careful on those. If Fishy. it's too good, don't. Yes, yeah, so they're trying yes. to get your password. Well, and if you see it too, report it to Facebook. You can report it just on that little arrow. You just click on that, and that helps Facebook know that this is still circulating. So in this theme of kind of being on your guard, the mm -hmm. other part of this is that 10 bands meme. 10 concerts you've oh, seen. You did that one. Seen it. One that you didn't. I did it. It was fun to okay. kind of make this yeah. list and try to have people guess which you've been to, which you haven't. Mm -hmm. Uh, this is one security expert is calling this a moderate security list. So this isn't something you should necessarily freak out about. But it goes to this idea of all the things we do on Facebook that we do for fun, that we think is just like, oh, this is cool. Like, let's do this. Let's take this quiz. Let's find out which full house character we are. No one is creating this content just so you can have a good time. They're all trying to get information from you, whether it's your email address. With the bands, it might be looking at these band names and trying to decide, mm, I wonder what age this person is. Mm -hmm. And then your demographic. To kind of build a social sure. But there's engineer. also a password. There's also a password, right, that a lot of yeah. people, a well, security it's question. It's a security question, and it's one of the most common ones that you have. What was the, your first concert that you went to? Because probably people don't know that about you. But sure. when you put that list out there, it makes it a little bit easier for someone a to guess. A little bit easier. Kim, yeah. this isn't something that I would be freaking out about. First of all, you don't know if someone has put their first concert on the list. You'd have to guess through 10 of them. Mm -hmm. You may have the same kind of luck just looking at the person's picture and guessing what band would have been popular that time. Right. Well, it just goes to show, though, I mean, how much personal information do we all put yes. out there on mm -hmm. Facebook? It's our social media account. Everything we put on there is personal. And it's a reminder to just keep your guard up. Yes. Don't get yes. too carried away and just be a little critical. OK, you know, what is it exactly that I'm putting out here? Is it too much? Is it a part of my password to anything? Is it part of a security question of mm. mine? And maybe rethink kind of what your passwords are, too. If they are too personal, yeah. then maybe someone could get that information. Oh, those passwords are so tricky, though, because you want it to be personal and to be easy to remember. People can't guess, but. <laughs> Yeah. Moderate amount of paranoia is not a bad thing no, when it comes yeah, to this stuff. To the internet. Yeah. Did you yep. leave yours up? Your 10, 10 concerts? You know, seriously, that is like the least personal thing about it. <laughs> it's an open book. We can just book. go through open your Facebook book. photos That's and find right. them all. Well,